Here is our storyboard we created for our trailer. First shot, we're going to have a mid shot of a girl sitting in the back of the car. She's going to be our main character. She's listening to music and she's in the car because she's moving to a new house. We then see the shot of the new house. Uh, this shot would be a location shot as we see them driving into the driveway. We then see the dad welcome the daughter to the new home and to set the scene we're also going to place boxes around to show people that it was because she's moved, like the daughter's moving house to live with her dad. We then see a shot um, later on during the day of her on her bed FaceTiming her friend. We are going to use a special software which lets you record the screen of uh, your laptop and um, to show the FaceTime call between the girl and her friend. Then we're going to have the girl end the call and then a, sh a low angle shot of the girl walking down the stairs. She's then going to hear a loud crash causing her to look around the house more. We're then going to have a title show, um, which reads once you see her. You're then going to see a shot of her closing the window. We thought it would also be a good idea as well for when she closes the window to first illustrate the ghost within the trailer the audience can see. We then have the title, You'll Never Be The Same. We then see a shot of her dad entering the main girl's room, checking if she is okay. A close-up shot where you can't see the ghost's face, however, you can see the arm of the ghost with the, with the, with the daughter. With her hand on her shoulder. Yeah. We then see the title of our film, which is called Revenge House. We then see a close-up of the girl who has her eyes closed and then they will open and they will be not her regular eyes, so they will be pitch black or bright red to show that she's been possessed. The screen will go black and then credits will appear on the screen.